shoppers, we have a lost little boy found in the toy department. He is three years old and answers to the name Brian. Would his mom or dad please report to the security office on the next level? Thank you. Wake up in the morning, feeling shine on me. I gotta go to the school. As well, government, neurosurgeon, nocturnal, tangerine, balcony, and quiche. You may notice that these words are also in your weekly reading assignment. Wait. I hope that you have all been studying for tomorrow's spelling test, which is worth 10% of your final mark. So uh, apply yourselves on to your next class. Hey, I really like your scarf, Luce. What, this old thing? Lucy, stay behind, please. I'd like a word with you. He's such a fascist. Attention. See you later, Luce. Hurry! Come on, don't think you should. It's supposed to be study. Oh, come on. Don't worry about it. Baxter's always late. Like... Anyways, we won't get caught. Someone will keep watch. You want us to Damon King, don't you? He's so gorgeous. Oh, no. Oh, I can't start. We have a lot in common, you and I. You really do. But what about well, we me? We must think of Amanda and her. What about you? We must oh. have said that. Oh, Even if oh such a hug. Oh, <laughs> what good is I'm that so to me? Answer me that, since you seem oh, to have sure. all the answers. Sure. Oh, Rebecca, we if only we were free to hearts. follow our hearts. We oh, gotta Sean, think I don't of mean Amanda anything. and Harvey. Would you shut up, Joey? Darling Rebecca. Not one moment of one day goes by when I don't think of you. And I don't dream of holding you in my arms. Oh, Sean, my darling. Hush, my sweet. He's kissing her. Oh! 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 Shut up! up! But we can't hurt Harvey. You know I don't love him anymore. Then think of your children. They can come with us. They like you, Sean. They really like you. And I know What did Mr. Like Radich want? The Dr. usual. Please. Get better marks or you'll jeopardize your year. Here. Start a new life together. I don't have to worry. I don't need spelling. I'm going to be a dancer. How much longer must we sneak around like Listen, I'm good at spelling and stuff, so if you want any help. I Besides, who wants to take grade 8 over again? Oh. Becky, you know I can't leave here. Not now. Not with a man who's still in a coma. I'm gonna meet him. Damon King. That gives a break. See? He's here autographing his book or something tomorrow at the bookstore. Wanna come? Why can't we tell the world? Darling. Okay. Yeah. <gasps> Corroborate. C O R O B B O R A T E. No. Two R's, one B. This is so boring. You've got to keep practicing. No, I don't. It's my right to flunk if I want to. Hello? Hi, honey. It's Mom. Hi, Mom. Listen, I'm still tied up downtown. Oh. How long's the meeting going to go on for? Should be about an hour. Is that OK? Yeah. Is your dad home yet? No, dad phoned. He's working late, too. No, that's okay. See you soon. Yeah, see you in an hour. Love ya. Okay. Bye. Bye bye. I'm tired of studying. Let's go have some fun. But we haven't finished yet. I don't care. Come on. I want to make you over. What? Lose? Come on. <laughs> what do you mean? It'll be fun. <laughs> I think we're going to meet him. And the moment he sees Steph, Stephanie, <gasps> the moment I saw you, I knew we were meant for each other. Oh, Damon, really? 
Now, I know you're only 14, but what does age matter when two people are in love? Oh, Damon. <sighs> if only we were free to follow our hearts. Oh, Damon, I can't. I don't love you. You don't love me? No, I love Heather. Oh, too bad. <laughs> Do this. It'll look better. See? That's nice. I wish I had more interest in clothes. You can borrow some of mine. I couldn't. My parents won't let me be sophisticated. They're kind of old-fashioned. My parents are perfect. They buy me everything I want. And they're always working. So they're never around here to bug me. Don't you get lonely? I'm self-sufficient. Come on, try something else. No, I'd better go. It's getting late. Vula, um, you can stay for supper if you want. My mom will be back soon. She's a gourmet cook. She takes classes and stuff. Thanks. My dad always makes us have supper together. Boring. That's OK. Thanks for letting me try on your clothes. And good luck with the test. Thanks for helping me study. Vula. Would you like to borrow this scarf? It's not that weird. Your parents won't mind. Really? Thanks. Listen. Keep it for as long as you like. I've got lots. See you tomorrow. Bye. Hello? Hi, honey. Hi, Mom. Listen, I'm still tied up downtown. Oh. That meeting, you know. How long will it go on for? Oh, you know what these deals are like. Yeah, I understand. Dad's still at the office? Yeah, I'll fix my own dinner. There's sushi in the fridge. Bye. Love ya. Time's up, pens down, papers over, and class is dismissed. Have this for you when you get back from lunch. I can't believe it. I'm sure I did. Everything we studied was on that task. That's great. Thanks a lot, Vula. I had a nice time studying this. That was fun. I had millions of people there. Curtis, don't be such a chicken. I'm not a chicken. He's just not my type. Heather's type lives in the zoo. Oh. Could you hold this for me? Oh, yeah, sure. Hawkins. Doris oh. Bell has a room closet in the main Jervis? foyer. Look all right. Yes. Okay. Let's, Let's go. go. <laughs> Take your bag. Hi, Damon. How are you? I watch your show all the time, and I do admire you. Hi. Oh, you look so adorable. Wow. Looks just like on TV. I'm gonna meet him. You don't have a book. I don't care. I'll get him to sign this. Thank you. Thank you. Hi. Hi there. I didn't buy a book because I left my money at home. But could you just sign this? I'm a real big fan. Sure. Anything for a fan. Do you think he'll kiss her? He does. We'll never hear the end of it. What's your name? Stephanie. How old are you, Stephanie? I'm 16. Sweet 16. Thanks. You know, Stephanie, one autograph, one kiss. That's my policy. Wash my cheek again. <gasps> oh, me, David. Oh, you kissed me. <laughs> Steph, this looks like a telephone number.
Heather? Very good. Erica? Not up to your usual standards. Joey Jeremiah? I didn't realize you knew Swahili. Lucy? Very good. A real improvement. Let's hope it continues. Obviously, one of the things to remember is that sounding a word out does not always help you spell the word. However, I am very, very impressed with the development that your spelling's been making. Have a nice weekend. Class dismissed. Staff, he gave me his number. Why shouldn't I call him? Seem like a good idea. Of course, it's a good idea. Attention, students. I passed, and all thanks to you. Visit I didn't do much. Sure, you did. You help me. Now I'm gonna help you. Let's go get you some new clothes. But I don't have any money. Don't worry about it. You want new clothes, don't you? Sure, but. Listen, I'll pick you up after my dance class. Bye, Bola. Bye. This is great. Probably won't even remember. I don't believe it. Neither do I. Oh, Heather. Hello, may I speak to Damon King, please? Thank you. Hi, is this Damon? Yeah, hi, this is Stephanie. You remember? He remembers. This is so romantic. This is so dumb. Don't be such a prude. Sure. I am not a prude. Yeah, sure, that sounds great. Yeah, you can pick me up. At the record store? Yeah, okay. Okay, thanks. Bye. A date! Tonight! He's gonna show me how a TV studio works. Oh, wow, a date with Damon King! Isn't it kind of dumb going out with some strange man? Heather, this is not a strange man. This is a TV star. We don't know anything about him. Sure we do. We watch him on TV all the time, don't we? I read about him. I feel like I practically know him. <laughs> That's publicity. And anyway, isn't it kind of late to go to a TV studio? TV studios are always open late. And isn't he kind of old for you? <sighs> You're just jealous. I'm not jealous. And anyway, what about your mom? You won't just be grounded, you'll be buried. How is she going to find out? Heather, relax. I could take care of myself. Here are today's sale items. <laughs> Looks like something my mother would buy. <gasps> hey, that's cute. Lula, those are clone clothes. I guess you're right. Hey, I really like this. Hmm, yeah, it's nice. So get one. It's too expensive. What size are you? Uh, petite. This is your size. What are you doing? Shh, be casual. Come on, Lucy, put it back. Come on, no one's seen us. Sure we can. They expect to lose stuff. Anyway, it's not that expensive. But it's wrong. It's okay, as long as we don't get caught. Come on. Come on. Come on. You want the sweater, don't you? This way. Don't be such a wimp, Vula. I'm not a wimp. You're a thief. So take it back. I can't take it. What if someone sees? Vula, just keep it. Come on. No one cares. Run!
I'll take the bag, ladies. This way. Hi there. Stephanie? Hi. Hop aboard. Let's you and me go have some fun. What's the matter with you kids? Don't you think shoplifting matters? The store has to pay for the things you steal, which means they have to raise the prices and people have to pay more. Listen, this isn't funny, you know. I bet you'll be singing a different tune when the police arrive. The police? I can't believe it. Sergeant Steeles, these are the two. Well, well. You again. And I see you brought a friend with you this time. Uh, these are the things the girls stole. There's a sweater here and... We're going to the studio. I thought we'd just stop for a bit and talk. Relax. I don't bite. Don't be so nervous. I'm not nervous. You're not afraid of me, are you? No. I just, I don't like it here, that's all. Why not? This is a nice place. It's quiet. Peaceful? You know, Stephanie, I think you and I have a lot in common. I really do. Don't. I want to go home. I'll take you home in a while. I want to go home now. now. Come on, Stephanie. You know what this is all about. Hey! Hey! took it. She told me to put it back. Honest. It was all my fault. We can talk about all this down at the station. Mommy? Please don't be mad. I've done something really stupid. Could you come and pick me up? I'm in a motel. I'll tell you later. I've come to pick up my daughter, uh, Bula. Bula? Bula. She's right over there, sir. I'll work at her. Thank you. I'm sorry I ever helped you. I used to think you were sophisticated, but you're just dumb. Bula, your parents are here. Would you come with me, please? Good luck, Bula. See what we have here? What have you done? 
Why do you do this? No. Lucy, we're having a little difficulty tracking down your parents. What are you doing? They're very busy. Well, we're going to have to charge you this time. Would you come with me, please? No more Lucy. No more Lucy for you. Listen to your father. I told you Lucy is not good for you. Okay? said on TV. I know, but what looks good on TV can be pretty gross in real life, I guess. What did your mom say? She was mad and all, but not as mad as I thought she'd be. She gave me that talk about not getting into risky situations. That speech. Yeah, but I kind of understood it this time. You were really lucky, Steph. I know. Hi. Hello. What'd your parents do? I'm not allowed to talk to you anymore. Look, well, I'm sorry. I was dumb. I have to go to court. I guess I'm in a lot of trouble. What did your parents say? They said I was a spoiled brat after all they've done for me. Maybe they're right. said we have to take family counseling. My parents probably won't be able to find the time. Listen, you want any more help? Like in spelling or math or anything? I don't mind. But I thought your parents said. I'll talk to them. They'll understand when they stop being so mad. So, you want any help? <laughs> 